today we open the doors to 25 stores like this. Some of them are owned by um, Public Mobile, and some of them are owned by independent dealers. What we're going to have is a uh, mixture of both corporately owned and um, independent dealer owned stores. To the public, they should look exactly the same. The fixtures, the signs all come from the same supplier. They're, we just can't see ourselves operating all the stores ourselves. So that number of 25 stores will grow to roughly 50 by May, and it'll double again by August, and double again by the end of the year. Part of being successful in this business is not just creating a great brand and great unifying purpose and having a great um, price point and a great offer for the customers. Part of it is understanding how to do distribution. And so the team we've got understands that you have to have your own distribution or distribution that is dedicated to your product. We will have and we'll be sharing with you in the months to come other deals that we've got in place with third parties who will sell our product alongside with their product. What you won't see us doing a whole lot of is just trying to get shelf space alongside all the other players. Why? Because most of the other players, the incumbents, are actually in locations with, where our demographic doesn't necessarily shop. So you'll see us in stores where our demographic lives, works, and plays. And that's why we're in an area like here. Now, 25 stores opening today. The offer, pretty straightforward, $40 unlimited talk and text. The other thing we've learned, though, uh, over the years is when you're an incumbent, you can launch a product even though it's not 100% ready. So Rogers did, does this, and Rogers always works to an aggressive timeline, and they make it work. And they do, I think, a hell of a good job. Bell, I would argue, tends to make sure the product is perfect before it actually gets out, although I've heard some nightmares of some of the products they've just recently launched. But look. We watched what, what our friends over at Wind uh, have done, and they've had some real stumbling blocks coming out of the gates, um, and we want to make sure we don't do that. So when we launch today, our network is not going to turn on. We're not going to turn our network on because we don't feel that it's actually 100% yet, and we want to make sure the customer experience is great. So our network is going to turn on in May. We could turn it on today, and we'd have a customer experience not dissimilar to Wind's. So you'd have a hole here and a hole there phone won't work everywhere. That, we think, is unacceptable. So we have the stores opening today, the network turning on in May. Some of you, I can see it in your eyes, are thinking, I think the guy's lost his mind. Why, why would a customer buy now when the network's not on? Why would I dish out somewhere between $75 and $125 for a handset? Well, here's the pre-launch offer. We, we were internally calling it our pioneer offer. If you're one of our pioneer customers, we are going to give you unlimited free long distance for life. So if you buy a phone from us between now and when the network turns on in May. Now, I want to be clear, it's a time limited offer. So if too many customers want to sign up for this thing, we have the right to say enough. But the reality is it's a great offer for customers. And so if you come in, you buy your phone right now, you will get free unlimited Canadian long distance for life, life defined as as long as you stay a customer in good standing. And so if you stay a customer in good standing, which means you never miss more than two payments in a row, which I think is very reasonable, then this offer will continue. It allows us, in the way that you know Ted Rogers was a very creative entrepreneur, it allows us to bring customers in, give them something, and at the same time, get them to make sure they, they do the one thing we need them to do. They need to make sure that they pay their bill. And so as long as they pay their bill, they don't lose this offer. So there's a great churn reducing effect on this as well. So this isn't something that's going to stay in market. We think long distance is something that we will bill for. And if you go around, you'll see some of the, uh, the price plans for long distance. But all of the plans that we offer are on an unlimited flat rate basis. So that's the news today. Um, 